Round number seven then, coming towards its conclusion. Not too much longer now for semi-final number one to get underway. Green light comes on now. Oh, a long pause and we're up and running. And Matze Janowski makes an absolutely sensational start out of gate number two. Rawls ran that first corner. Dudek also in the thick of the action. Dudek and Leon Madsen going handlebar to handlebar down the back straight. Leon Madsen now just about hangs on the second place. Dudek up the inside. Will he get there? No, he doesn't quite get there. Mickelson's missed out. But what a start for Matze Janowski, the home crowd favourite. Looking good out in front. Madsen having to work hard to hang on the second place. Dudek now around the outside, but Matze Janowski looking good for the final now. Yeah, he certainly is. And the one thing Leon Madsen didn't need in the first turn was Janowski getting there before him. Pinning him down has put him under so much pressure in the opening laps from Dudek, who's uh, still trying to work the inside. And I tell you what, he's going to oh. take this one right down to the flag. He is indeed. One lap to go. Matze Janowski looking absolutely set for the final. Clear in front, Dudek coming on strong. Second and third is yet to be decided. Leon Madsen closes the door. Janowski wins the race. Leon Madsen joins him in the final. Had to work hard there. Dudek really. Really going great runs in third place, but the home crowd overjoyed with the performance from Matze Janowski. Delighted for him. He's had a tough time of late. Speedway of Nations, no, it didn't work out. Recent Grand Prix hasn't been anywhere near his best. Well, that was much more like it. Brilliant start. Matze Janowski through to the final. He wins semi-final number one. Leo Madsen follows him through in second place. Patrick Dudek and Mikko Mikkelsen Missing out, their Grand Prix is over. Yeah, Kevin, you said it. Janowski's been low on confidence, but it was so important to get across Leon Madsen there. And this put Madsen under so much pressure on the opening laps. Dudek brave, he had to keep it on there. Rides in very, very wide and allows Leon Madsen uh, to get clearly up the inside. But Dudek would not let it go. And he comes in here. I tell you what, he doesn't have to, have to turn the bike right. He goes through gate two. Ooh. Such a <laughs> tight entry into turn one there on the second lap. And he has to turn the bike very, very hard. But he would not give in. He pulled every line he possibly could. But Madsen hanging on in there. But that is the one thing. If you take the inside gate and the rider off two gets across you, it may have been part of uh, Ty Wolfenden's thinking and leaving himself clear on the outside. <laughs>